This is the antenna extension mod. And this is the buzzer locator mod. Okay, this is a quick video on some mods that I did to my quadcopter that improved it greatly. The tools needed is a soldering iron, some solder, and a precision screwdriver set. It's like a small Phillips head screwdriver. And the parts needed is some thin speaker wire with like a plastic coating and some buzzers. I got these on eBay, five of them for $1.79. They're three volt buzzers. And on eBay, the seller was Tesco Malls, and they come from China, so it took three weeks for it to arrive in the mail. Okay, the shoulder button on the remote control controls the lights. And my voltmeter shows that it's right around three volts. Okay, the first thing is you use one of these small Phillips head screwdrivers to remove this screw right here that holds the light bulb in place. And then you remove the outer body and it's just held on by like a friction fit over each arm. Then you pull it off and there's a little piece of tape holding one of the wires. Then it removes. And I also remove the LED lights. There's like two screws on each one. And you follow the wires from the lights and it comes to this little connector right here and the connector to the front light goes right there and you can just pull it off so here's the parts that were removed the front light the screws from the bottom LED light strips and this little piece of plastic Okay, for the antenna mod, I took a little strip of speaker wire and soldered it onto the stock antenna wire. So it's like a six inch extra piece. and I tuck it in underneath. Pull it out the other side. Gives me a whole lot better reception. Before I'd get short little video clips, like it was becoming unconnected from the remote control, but now I get super long videos. Okay, the next thing I did was I took the long single headlight wire and I cut it right in the middle and I soldered on the little three volt buzzer. The red wire goes to the plus on the front of the speaker. And the reason I used the long single headlight wire is because there's just two strands and the bottom lights have like four strands into each one so it's just easier to use this one and then where this wire where the light wires used to be is where I plug this into and the connectors are the same so the positive and negative are both the same and then I kind of like wrap it around so it's not dangling. 
gives it a little bit of stability. So now when I lose it in the grass, I can just hit the shoulder button. And the buzzer sounds and I can locate it. And the stock quadcopter weighs 120 grams. And, and the modified one weighs about 84 grams. It's pretty amazing how much stronger the quadcopter is when you take that ringed body off. And remember to switch into mode two because it gives the quadcopter more power. Okay, I just crash landed over here somewhere. See if I can find it. Yeah, I can hear the beep. Yeah, there it is. Easy to find. Thank you.